<laughs> Why do you feel the need to shout all the time? I don't, I just have a loud voice. Okay. Uh, and I'm used to the politics of the street. Yeah. Uh, uh, so I, I, I suppose I probably somewhat estimate the amplification in, in the doll. Although I have to say, it, compared to some of the mumbling that goes on, yeah. uh, it might be helpful uh, to be a bit clearer. Uh, one of the most depressing things I find about debate in the doll is the scripted nature of uh, government yeah. so-called debate. It's not debate at all. They're just reading off a script, often mumbling, often mumbling deliberately. Uh, particularly on controversial issues, so nobody really knows what they've said. Mm. Uh, so I, I wouldn't make any apologies about, I think, trying to s put it across in clear and understandable terms what, what uh, our policies are, what we think of. It's a bit of a performance with you, though, isn't it? Uh, no, it's no. not. I mean, I, 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 I speak things as I see them. I'm not, I'm not judging the, 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 uh, the sincerity of your words, I just suppose in your delivery. I mean, you're really kind of forcing it home and you're very expressive and uh, loud and... Well, I, I, I think, I mean, I've been doing public speaking for a long time, yeah. uh, and the more you do it, yeah. I suppose, the more used to doing it you get, and um, you get a little bit more confident about not operating off a script, but I, I think, to be honest, that's better. I think people out there, the public, appreciate the fact that you're not scripted, mm. and that you're saying it as you see it, and that you express views with, with conviction, because you actually feel conviction. I don't do it for the sake of it. Has anyone ever told you to turn it down a bit? No. No? 